Although the strength of BTC Embedded Platform is to manage models and production C code in one single test project, it is also possible to create a test project for pure Simulink models. This is especially relevant during the early stages of a project where code might not yet be available. The profile creation can be initiated using the respective menu option. On the first page of the upcoming wizard, you can select the model which you would like to test. These optional wizard pages available by clicking the Next button make it possible to decide which subsystems of the model hierarchy should be available as independent units under test and also if you wish to exclude certain parameters should they not be calibratable in the test project. As you can see, the model analysis has determined that there are six imports, four calibrations, three displays, and three outports in the interface of the top-level subsystem. For every element, a hyperlink to the model is provided, allowing you to inspect the blocks, ports, and subsystems. For each signal, valuable information like data type and min-max values are directly identified. When selecting a different subsystem, the context-sensitive dashboard automatically adapts its content and shows the interface of that subsystem, which can be independently tested without the need to manually isolate it from the original model. If the model you are testing changes, you can easily update your test project and all relevant test data will be adapted automatically. If the names of functions or interfaces change, they can be mapped to ensure consistency of all test data. We hope you've enjoyed this video of BTC Embedded Platform. Please also have a look at our other videos and don't hesitate to contact us if you have any further questions.